I'm Josephine here with Jimra, and today we have an amazing whole body workout. It's strength training, compound moves, and at the end, 10 minutes of cardio to really burn those extra calories, get your heart rate up, all right? So I'm gonna be using five pound dumbbells today because it's a full body workout, but it's your workout, so you do what's best for you. If you've got threes, if you wanna do body weight, if you've got tens, you're feeling really strong today, your workout, your body, you pick what's best for you. Make sure you have water and a towel nearby. Take a break whenever you need it, but try to keep moving as much as possible. Each moves 45 seconds on with a 15 second break in between. All right, so let's get started with our five minute warm up. Let's march it out. Good, we're just warming up the body right here, getting the blood flowing. What I love about this workout is it's all strength training, whole body workout, upper and lower body together, and then at the end, you really push yourself hard by getting 10 minutes of high intensity cardio, which I love. Let's take it out wide. Good. Really lift the heels off the ground, get the arms moving, warm up the body. Now let's tap it side to side. Here we go. Warming it up. Squeezing the back, chest is up. Nice light warm up just to get the blood flow going. Want to always make sure to do a proper warm up before you get into any workout. Good, let's add some glute kicks, hamstring curls right here. Squeezing the back, kicking the glutes. Make sure not to hold your breath, breathe. Good, now let's bring it up. Bring the knees in front and reaching up, activating the core, warming up the whole body. A few more seconds here, hold on to it. Should be getting warmer now. Get that knee up. Five, four, three, two, one. Good, now tap and reach out. Nice straight arms, tapping, twisting the torso, warming up the core. Is your heart rate coming up yet? Mine is. Now let's reach it up and over. Nice straight arms. Now we're opening and closing the arms. Oh, my shoulders are already burning, baby. I don't even have any weights in my hands yet. Good, let's bring it up and down. Some nice squats, warming up the body. Nice and slow and controlled. Five more here. Are you warming up yet? Good, arm circles forward with a march. And backwards. Good, let's bend side to side, right and left. Stretching out the inner thigh. Pushing through the heel, keeping the chest up. You can have your hands on your hips here. Last five. Good, march it back up. Let's stretch out the hamstrings.
Now let's twist the torso. And let's take it up to some jumping jacks. Last 10. Whew, march it out. All right, some shoulder rolls back, loosening up the chest. And let's get ready and let's get started. Cool it down, bring the heart rate down. Whew. I'm warm, are you? All right, so let's go ahead and grab our weights, starting with a squat to front raise. Here we go, 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off, in three, two, one. Squat down, front raise up. Squat down, core is tight, front raise. Get deep into that squat. When you do the front raise, core is activated, and don't bring the arms past the 90 degree line. Full body, upper and lower body combos, compound movements. Oh yeah, these are so metabolically efficient as I always say. Ten more seconds here, hold on to it. Get deep into that squat, pushing through the heel, chest is up. And done, nice job. Shake it out for a second. First move in the books, yes. All right, next move is a single leg reverse lunge to alter till narrow row. I'll show you. So we reverse lunge, narrow row, one side only, let's go. Reverse lunge, tap, narrow row. Reverse lunge, tap the ground, lean over, narrow row. I really feel it in the standing glute. Whew. It burns doing single leg movements. And we're also working the upper body in there. A few more seconds here, hold on to it. Still gotta do the other side. My booty is on fire. Whew. Nice job, switch it up. Man, that standing leg, you really feel it in the glute. It's working, baby. All right, so we did that side, switch it over to the other side. Here we go, three, two, one. Tap down, lean over, narrow row. Reverse lunge with a tap and a narrow row. Pushing through that front heel. Almost there. Hold on to it, you can do it, 45 seconds. You got this. And done. Whoo, shake those legs out, baby. That standing leg glute, whoo. Third move. All right, next move, side lunge to push out. Here we go, in five, four, three, two, and one. Side lunge, come up, push out, chest press. Stay on the same leg. We're really gonna burn out one side at a time. Working the lower body and the upper body together with these compound movements. Abs are always activated and engaged. Get low into that side lunge. 90 degrees right here, baby. Ten seconds till we move to the other side. You got this. Stick with it. 
and done. Other side. You really feel it in that glute. Whew, we're doing lots of glutes already. I'm feeling this one. Here we go, other side. In three, two, one. Tap it out, come to center, push straight out. Ten seconds, stick with me here. 45 seconds of work. You get a break in three, two, one. Great job. Booty is on fire, shoulders and chest should be burning. All right, next move we've got is a curtsy lunge to bicep to bent arm lateral raise. Starting on one side, here we go. Curtsy lunge, come up, bicep, Lateral raise, stay on the same leg. Again, we're burning out one glute. Bicep, lateral raise. But we're still getting some bicep and shoulder action in there. I like doing single leg movements because it really burns out one leg at a time versus giving it a rest if you're doing alternating. So you get more bang for your buck. Keep the chest up, bend that back knee. Last one, here we go. Yes, gotta do the other side. Woo! Get ready, is your heart rate up? Mine is. These compound movements, they really are efficient. Here we go in three, two, one. Curtsy lunge, come up. Bicep, bent arm, lateral raise, staying on the same side. I know it feels like you wanna alternate those legs, but nope, burning one glute out at a time. Ten seconds, stick with me. It's all mental strength right now for these last ten seconds of any move. This is when you want to quit. So when I challenge you to stick with it. Yes, great job at home. You're doing awesome. All right, next move is a elbow to knee tricep. All right, here we go, one side at a time. So elbow to knee, try to balance tricep overhead. Elbow to knee, using the oblique, balancing, using the core, tricep overhead, staying on one side. Whew. You really get a lot of core action when you balance on one leg. Stability is key. Try to get the elbow to the knee, lift that leg up, then tricep overhead. Oh yes, this full body action here. My triceps are burning, my glute on the standing leg is burning. Whole body burn. Five, four, three, two, one. Wow, it looks easy, but it's not. It hurts, but in a good way. All right, we have to do the other side. You know what to do. It's coming up. You might be better balanced on one side than the other, and that's okay. Tap your foot down. Here we go. So we tap, bring it up, balance, tricep overhead. If you need to tap the leg that you're trying to keep up down, it's okay. Do your best and forget the rest, baby. But I like you to try to keep that leg up to really work the core and the balance, getting some oblique action. No more love handles here, right? So go slow and controlled on these moves. It's not about speed, it's about form. See, I even lost it for a second there in control. Oh, my tricep is feeling it. Five, 
four, three, two, one. Oh, my triceps felt it more than anything on that one. How about you? All right, next move we've got is alternating oblique to bicep. So we're gonna be in a sumo squat here. We're gonna lift, lift, hammer, curl. So lift using the obliques, more oblique action. Back to back oblique action. Lift, lift, working the shoulders, biceps and obliques. Boom, boom, hammer, curl. Kind of get a little low into it so your quads are getting into it as well. So get that full body and not just the upper body. Oblique, oblique. Oh yes, welcome to the gun show, baby. These guns are on fire. Ooh, five seconds. And done, nice job. All right, next move, lateral walk with three squats, okay? So we walk, walk, three squats down, okay? Here we go. Walk, walk, one, two, three, come up. Walk, bent knee, walk. One, two, three, come up. Walk, get low, quads should be on fire. Glutes feeling it with three pulses right here. Come up, bend the knees. Do not be afraid to get low with it. Come up, bend, bend, two walks, three pulses. Oh my gosh, my booty's on fire. One, two, three, last time. Over, over. One, two, three. Oh yes, I even cheated a little myself there by not getting as low as I should have. Great job, catch your breath before the next move. All right. I have a lot of sweat coming out because I'm working hard. Our next move is a shoulder press to knee crunch. One, down, two, down. So this is working the shoulders, the core, and the quadriceps. So lift it up. Your hip flexors, flexors should be working too. Abs are really engaged. Pull them in. Reach to the sky, balance. Ten seconds. Ha! Huh. My abs, my shoulders, they're burning. Great job. Are you ready for the next move? Take a 15 second break here. We got a sumo squat, so widen out the legs with a wide row pulse. Are you ready? Let's boogie in three, two, one. Sumo squat, double pulse. Sumo squat, wide row. Sumo squat, double pulse. Double pulse, wide row. Very good. One, two, lean it over. One, two, work the back. Pulses, they work, baby. They give that extra burn that you feel. Lean over. Chest is up on the sumo and pulsing back on the row. 10 seconds, stick with me here. You got this, baby. And done, great job. Next move we have is a lateral leg raise to lateral bicep. Staying on one side, again, working our balance, our core, legs and upper body combo. In three, two, one. So lateral leg raise, lateral bicep. Try to keep the leg off the ground like I am. It takes coordination and balance, lateral bicep. Lateral leg raise, leg does not touch the ground. If you can do it, I challenge you. Lots of balance, lots of coordination here. You got it. Get that leg up high, keep it floating. Lateral bicep. It takes a lot of effort to not tap the ground. But if you have to, I get it. Some days 
our balance is off more depending on sleep and a lot of other things. And done. All right, other side. Whew, feeling the standing leg putting all that weight on it. Really works the booty too. Here we go. Get ready, catch your breath. You got this, other side in three, two, one. We have a lateral leg raise, stay balanced. Ah! See, even I lose my balance. One side might be easier than the other, which is very normal. Stronger on one side. Lateral bicep. Good, leg stays, hovers on the ground. Try not to let it down if you don't have to. All about challenging our bodies to take them to the next level, right? You got this, baby. Ten seconds. Hold strong. It's hard to balance for 45 seconds on each leg, but I believe in you. And done. Great job. Whew, shake out that standing leg. Next move, we have a reverse lunge. Push out. Side raise. Are you ready? Starting on one side in three, two, one. Reverse lunge, come up, push out. Lateral raise, reverse lunge, push out. Lateral raise, all on one side only. Reverse lunge, push out. Lateral raise, you got this. Working the legs, working the core and the shoulders, baby. Chest is up on that reverse lunge. Ten seconds, stick with me, then we got the other side. Five, four, three, two, and one. Great job, gotta do the other side now. Flip it over, get ready for it. Ooh, catch your breath. Doing awesome here. Here we go. Reverse lunge. Push out. Lateral raise. Keep the chest up. Bend that back knee 90 degrees. Push it straight out. Arm is straight. Lunge, push out, lateral raise. Great job, bend that back knee 90, keep the chest up. Keep the core activated, arms strong, you got this. And done, great job. All right, next move we've got, we're gonna go narrow squat, wide squat. Kick it back, alternating. Here we go. Narrow squat, wide squat, tricep kick back. Narrow squat, wide squat, tricep kick back. Doing great. Oop, forgot my narrow. Narrow squat, wide squat, tricep kick back. Whew, squeeze those inner thighs together. You really work your legs when you're doing a narrow and then a wide squat and then work in the upper body as well. 10 seconds here. Whew. And done. Great job, you guys. How we feeling? Whew, my booty's burning, upper body's burning. Next move, donkey kick with a rear fly balancing. This is this is tough. Here we go. Donkey kick, balance, rear fly. Donkey kick, balance, rear fly. You have to tap the foot down. I get it. You just donkey kick, tap, rear fly. Otherwise, balance, baby. Advanced version. Your standing leg should be on fire. Donkey kick. Donkey kick, balance, rear, fly, and done. Great job, gotta do the other side now. 
A lot of balance, a lot of coordination, a lot of glute. Here we go, let's get ready for this. Are you ready? I gotta mentally prepare myself. Here we go. Donkey kick, balance, rear fly. Flex the foot, kick it back, squeeze the glute. Rear fly, leaning over for both moves. This is tough. Remember, you have to tap the foot down. I get it. One side might be stronger than the other, but it's good to challenge yourself with these balance and core moves. Plus the standing leg, the booty is on fire. Whew, last one. Oh my God, I almost lost it. Done, great job. Whew, see, I was losing it at the end. I'm human too, don't judge me, okay? All right, you're doing great. Couple more moves before we hit that cardio blast. Here we go. We've got a narrow squat, narrow row, overhead tricep. Narrow squat, narrow row, overhead tricep. Full body, baby. Narrow squat, lean over. Narrow row, overhead tricep. Great job. Narrow squat. Narrow row, overhead tricep, three moves in one, baby. Oh yeah. I'm in the zone, are you? 10 more seconds, stick with me. Almost there. Last one, great job you guys, we're almost there. You can do anything, we've got two more moves of strength before we go into our cardio segment. All right, we have a staggered leg, deadlift, bicep shoulder press. So starting on one side, staggered leg, deadlift, bicep, shoulder press. Same leg, staggered leg, deadlift, putting all the weight on one side, which really activates the glute and the hamstring. Neutral grip, shoulder press. Push into that heel. I love doing these single leg moves because they really burn out the booty. And then with the upper body combinations, you get a whole body workout. So you're not wasting any time. 10 seconds, then we switch to the other side. Five, four, three, two, one. Great job, other side. So whatever leg you were on before, you're gonna switch it around, all right? So before we are on that one, now we're on this one. Are you ready? Here we go. In three, in two, in one. Staggered leg deadlift. Bicep, neutral grip, shoulder press. Pushing into that standing leg, flat back. here. Stick with me. You got this. Hold on to it. Last three, two, and one. Great job. I've got good news and I've got better news. Good news is strength training's over. Better news is 10 minutes of cardio. Yes. Drop your weights. Get ready. We've got fast feet with a touch. Fast feet for four, with a touch to the ground. One, two, three, four, touch. One, two, three, four, touch it down. One, two, three, four, touch. Call it a football run, call it fast feet. Call it what you like. I want you to bend the knees, tap. One, two, three, four, tap it down. Woo, is your heart rate coming up? Get ready for cardio, heart rate pumping, Fun. 10 seconds, stick with me here. Boom, really get, bend those knees, get low. And done. Catch your breath, 15 quick seconds. Get, get a sip of water if you need it. Going into the next move. Repeat her knees, staying on one side, then the other. Are you ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. Squeezing, 
tapping. If you're really advanced, hop it up like this. Hop, hop, hop. If you want to modify, just bring the knee to the chest, using the core, getting the heart rate up. Because when you put your hands over your head, it brings the heart rate up automatically. We still have to do the other side. We're burning out that left standing leg. You can go faster, or if you have to modify, take it slower. Your workout, your body, your choice. Let's go. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Catch your breath. Shake out that standing leg. Ah, booty's on fire. Gotta go to the other side. You can hop, you can modify. Go fast, go slow. Your workout. Here we go, 45 seconds on the clock. But try to get that knee up, activating the core, bringing the arms straight up overhead to get the heart rate up. Remember, you can hop. This really gets the heart rate up. Or you can modify and tap slower. Or go fast, keeping the foot on the ground. Almost there. You're doing great. Stick with it. Last 10. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out. Remind me later why I chose so many one-legged exercise. Exercises, my butt is on fire right now. Woo! All right, get ready for the last, next move. It is glute kick speed bag. Here we go. Kick the glutes, speed bag up. Again, you wanna try to kick your glutes. And with the speed bag, if the hands are over the head, heart rate comes up higher. Good. Like you're hitting a speed bag. If you're feeling frisky, let's go the other way with the speed bag. Yeah! Woo! So try not to do it down here. Up here, heart rate comes up. Arms over the head, 10 seconds. Go a little faster. Five, four, three, two, one. How you doing? Good news. Five moves in, five to go. Better news, five moves to go. Yes. All right, next move. Alternating kicks with punches. Are we ready? Three, two, one. Kick and punch, kick, punch. Using your core, using the upper body, kicking. You wanna take it up and up, kick. Hop it up. Yes. Turn it into a jump kick. Modifying, try to reach for the toe. Really modifying, keep it low and slow, but keep moving. Yes. All right, we've got different levels for your needs. We're here for you. Oh, my quads are feeling this one. Yes, 10 seconds. Push yourself for the last 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Boom. Woo! Feeling that. You're doing great. Next move single leg reverse lunge with the alternating punch. Here we go in four, three, two, one. Reverse lunge, punch, punch, balance. Reverse lunge, punch, punch, balance. So you can still work your balance and your core and your cardio together. Look at this. Yes, full body action, baby. Just holding up your leg like this, making your heart rate go up. Because you have to use more muscles to stabilize. We still gotta do the other side. 10 seconds, stick with me. Yes, you can do it. I got it, you got it. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, yes. Give yourself a clap, pat on the back. We gotta do the other side. All right. Are you ready? In five, four, three, two, one. 
Reverse lunge, balance, punch, punch. Core is tight. Arms are up. Body's working. You go faster or take it slower. Your choice. Almost there. Hold on to it. Come on. Burn out that leg. Get the heart rate up. Hold your balance. I'm holding on to it too. Three, two, one. Great job, you guys. We're almost there. Got a couple more moves. All right, scissor squat, alternating knee cross. My heart rate's through the roof. Breaks over. Three, two, one. Scissor squat, knee, knee. Scissor squat, knee, knee. Working the core. Heart rate's coming up. Get low in that squat, knee, knee. Scissor the feet, squat, knee, knee. Work the abs, standing ab work. in this cardio segment with the balance and the core work. Feels good, baby. Almost there. Take a breath for a second. Five seconds. Lateral jump dugs. Three, two, one. Lateral jumps. Lateral jump over. Dunk it. Any basketball players here? lateral jumps too much tap it and then jump and reach otherwise hop it over jump hop it over jump doing great hold on 10 seconds oh yes I love that countdown yes good job okay we're so close to the end can you do it got two more moves you got this Whew. Run forward and backward. Here we go in five, four, three, two, one. Run forward, run backward. Use your arms, forward and backward. Come on, get the knees up, forward, backward. Forward, backward. It's like two to four runs forward, two to four back. Whatever you have space for. But I want your arms moving your heart rate coming up, you're working on different planes, forward plane, backward plane, working side to side, I love it. Works all types of functionality, muscles, stabilizing muscles when we work in different planes. Five, four, three, two, one. Great job, final cardio move of the day. 45 seconds, everything you got, lay it out. This is it. How do you want to finish today? Strong in four, three, two, one. Squat, jump, run for four. One, two, three, four. Squat, jump, run for four. One, two, three, four. Squat, reach for the sky. One, two, three, four. Squat, jump, reach up. You got this. Hold on to it, baby. You can do anything for 45 seconds. 10 seconds. Give it to me. Finish strong. Last one. You did it. Awesome job. I am so proud of you. The 10 minute cardio blast at the end really kicks butt. You did great. Whole body workout. Great job. Let's cool it down. How we feeling? 
March it out. Catch your breath. Grab water if you need it. Towel off. This is the part where we're slowing it all down, right? Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. A couple more like that. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Two more. Inhale. Keep marching. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Great job. All right, let's slowly go side to side. Stretching it out. We're going to hold one side in five, four, three, two, one. Hold one side. Get a nice deep inner thigh stretch. Good. Switch to the other side. Bend that knee. Get a nice deep stretch. At the end of the workout, we do static stretching where we hold positions to get a nice deep stretch. Good. Bring the feet to center. Put the hands on the knees, not on the knees, on the thigh. Cat and cow. Arching the back up, releasing any tension, looking up to the sky. For five, four, three, two, one. Good. Bring the shoulder across. Arm across for shoulder stretch. Breathing. Oh, my heart rate's still coming down. If you need to come down a little slower, keep marching lightly. Bring that heart rate down very slowly. Never just go to the floor right away after jumping. You want a heart rate to come gradually down before you do anything seated on the ground. And switch. Great job. And reaching over. Get a nice stretch on the side body. Other side. Reach long fingertips. Center. Bend the knees, stretching side to side, right and left. And hold one side. Switch the other side. Good. Come on up. Bring the heel out, stretching out the hamstring. Reach for the toe, lean over. On up, switch, other side. Come up, tricep. Ooh, we did a lot of tricep action there. other side. Good. Next stretch. We're going to come down and stretch out our hip flexor. Reach up to the sky. back up. Switch to the other side. Stretching out the hip flexor. Bend the back knee. Get a nice stretch here. Reach to the sky. Come back to center. Roll the shoulders out. Up to the ears and back. Releasing any tension. With the neck and the back, we hold a lot of tension there. Good, and bring it forward. And roll out the neck. Let's 
switch directions. Hold, ear to shoulder, almost there, stretch it out. Gotta get those kinks out of the neck. And switch. Take three deep breaths. Inhale, exhale, reach up to the sky. Inhale, exhale, reach up long and strong. Inhale, exhale, reach up, bring it down the center. Awesome work today, everybody. You did it. Whole body workout, strength training, cardio. You burned a lot of calories, feeling stronger. See you next time. Great job.